Yes, today I will show you how to create a perfect a plus screen in code basis. So first create a sample project in your code basis and language will be Kotlin because uh, this project is going to be in Kotlin. So first uh, as you open your project you can see here I have used linear layout as, as a further layout uh, just I converted the text view to linear layout for using is using it as further layout for my image view here so okay I have given Android accessible OS yes, sample as I have a icon icon called sample in my drawable folder here you can see here preview okay and padding will be full here is the preview now let me show you how to add a icon in your project using empty manager first of all you have to open the latest empty manager beta version uh, link has been given below after opening in go to your data folder and you can find here com.tyron.code open it simply and go to your project and here is our project and go to app folder src main and as folder here is the drawable folder and paste your icon here okay after doing this we have to create a layout called activity home layout as it is our home layout for our home activity here you can see the layout preview okay so let's close activity home and activity main now you can see in the main activity we have we has uh, we have imported android dot content dot intent as we are going to use it for launching home uh, launching home activity from main activity and we used android.os.handler here for making a 3 second delay and we added other imp important imp import for our project and window manager and other imports for making the uh, status bar transparent and here is we have a method called set window flag and it has been used for making the status bar transparent to look the application to make the application more better here you can see that i have used if build button person equals 19 or build button is greater than 21 then it will make the status bar transparent okay so here i have used handler dot post delete to make a three second delay here and you can see that i have used intent for launching my activity and used finish finish uh, method to close the main activity permanently so that when the user press back button and uh, there will be no main activity and the application will be exit directly from home activity and you can see uh, see here i have added support action bar height to hide my action bar from my main activity let's go to home activity now here we ha i have done simply added content view activity dot home activity home as you can see there is a layout called activity dot activity home and then i added my home activity in my android manifest xml here you can see here i have added my activity in my android manifest xml okay now run the project let's see the output Okay. after opening it you can see a plus screen of 3 second and it has been redirected us to our home activity okay so let's when i press the back button it directly exited me from the app let's open it again 
you can see here it uh, it is making a three second delay then my home activity so if you like my tutorial please subscribe for latest tutorials and i am going to give more kotlin tutorials for beginners in codices thank you